I'm Zach UAX. I'm Ian Celtic Grizzly. And we are. Ian? The Righteous Cosmo Force. Righteous Cosmo Force. Yeah, I, I see, I told you it's a bit of a mouthful. I'll it, get it it's down. It's totally I'll get a it bit down. of a mouthful. Booyah. We'll say RCF probably in the future. And this is Castlevania. Dracula Castlevania. X. Uh, oh, balls. Oh, balls. I didn't map my controller. So, yeah, this game is considered to be kind of a uh, bastardized uh, one. And uh, though a lot of people do like it still. Well, this is pretty in intense for an older game. It looks pretty good, that's for sure. I'm not that good at Castlevania. I like the uh, newer ones that are closer to playing like Metroid. These are, this is like playing uh, the old, old Castlevanias on NES. Okay, is he gonna turn around? No, he's gonna fall, okay. Interesting. Wow, they didn't really have borders for those guys. Oh man! One of my favorite parts about the old Castlevania is that you moonwalk down the stairs. And that it just like, with this theme, it goes perfectly with Thriller. Oh, Thriller! Yeah, I'll keep the Because we don't know any words. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, look at him dancing up there. Look at that. He's just like, oh, I'm going to get you. He's got his head. He's got his head. I'm going to get you. He's like, Thriller, Michael Jackson, we're having fun now. Oh, what the, the balls fuck? was that? I think I just used a bunch of magical power. You went Super Saiyan there for a second. destroyed all my enemies, and I don't know how I did that. That was pretty awesome. That was actually pretty cool. Okay, I got a feeling he's... Oh, no, he is your enemy. I, I thought he was going to be a friend or something, too. I know, I was like, he didn't die from you throwing it That was like a direct hit from the axe. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yo, fuck. Your axe has no power here. <laughs> Boom. Oh, nice shot. Right in the face. Pow, right in the kisser. 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 One of these days, Alice. Pow, right to the moon. Pow. Although I do love that he kind of like power walks up those stairs. Yep. He's like, I'm getting where I want to go now. Yeah, that's right. You Wonder Woman him with that lasso. Mm-hmm. I feel like he'd kind of talk like Duke Nukem. I'm getting where I'm going now. Pretty much. Balls of steel. Yes, that is his voice. I know they don't give him one, but that is his voice. That is his voice. Yeah. Boop. Boop. Oh man, these games. I'm not against Castlevania at all, but I hate it when they make these games so hard to control. Like, you can't control this jump in midair. Oh, weird, okay. Yeah. Which, I mean, I know it makes no sense when you can in a video game, but it just, like, it's part of being a game. It's an intuitive part of making a game. Oh, oh that was the weapon that kills everything on screen. Okay. Oh, what the fucking flying Medusa, Medusa head? head? Yeah, what yeah. the balls? This game is all sorts of crazy. Fuck you. Would you rather have the weird throwing star thing or the X? I think I'd rather have uh, this because it's, uh, like, that a boomerang. Oh, neato, neato. I don't think I can jump over that. I gotta go back. At least I got a uh, turkey. Would you eat a turkey you found out of a candle? Uh, wh what? Would you eat a turkey you found out of a candle? Probably not. Because this is the shit that this game makes us accept. God damn it. God damn it. I really suck at Castlevania. Well... I don't think I'd be doing much better. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna kill some zombies, son! So, quick question, what are you supposed to look like? Like, I'm trying to figure this out. Are you like a crusader, or is this like a tunic old school kind of thing? Or? I think he's part of the Belmont family, so they'd be Transylvanian. Okay, so I can... Wait, right? Or were they... They were like Scottish or some shit, weren't they? The Belmont family? Yeah, because Castlevania kind of goes with the... Uh, like Dracula lore. Do I need to look this up right now? Oh, well, you can if you want to. That's a very... Oh, fuck! Oh, did you see that? Damn it. Yeah, I I'm very bad at this. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sure if you're good at Castlevania, you're either cracking up or, like, sighing gently to yourself. <laughs> fuck! I died. There you go. Just look up what the Belmont family was. 
So not not the uh, wiki for this game, but the actual Belmont family? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well then. Um... I mean... Yeah, I think so. Or you might have to look up Bel just Belmont Family Origins. I don't know. This is a Japanese game, so they almost certainly are like half Japanese or some dumb shit. Eh, you never know. Like Solid Snake to begin with was part of Japanese. You know what Solid Snake looks like, right? Yeah. Snake from Smash Brothers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was supposed to be like half Japanese. He looks 100% white. Well, yeah, they kind of make all their people and stuff look like that, don't they? They do. Alright, so it's saying here the family... Belmont family crest and name history. Origins available are the English alternate English, so the English Belmont family. Um, yeah, it's looking like it's from England. Migration from Normandy. Norm that was a hold? Class. 1066. They lived in Dorset and okay, that's that, Sire. That's enough, dude. That's plenty. <laughs> okay. So yeah, basically English, Scottish, pretty much. What is that thing? Where did it come from? Oh, it actually helped me cross that pit, so that's nice, but it hurt me. See, that's a pit right there. That does not look like a pit. No, and the fact that it is also stepping in those pits doesn't make any sense. It does not, and that's kind of annoying. Oh, yeah, that's fair. Fuck this game. Huh. Oh, oh, oh. what the... Okay. What? Okay. That's a thing. It's a thing. Well, good job, whatever just happened. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, look at the... Look at the crazy Mode 7 graphics going on back there. Got some blue flames. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know. I think the axe is a little more useful. I don't really know, though. Yeah, we can always ask them to comment what their favorite weapon is. Yeah. Actually, yeah. What's your favorite Castlevania weapon, everybody? Um, I tend to stick to the battle axe just because it's so hard to hit up there like that. With the uh, with the boomerang? With anything. Oh, what the... Oh. Is that Jaguar? Freaking... Oh, oh! Cerberus! Yeah, look at that! Okay. Oh, oh! I guess he's a hellhound. Oh, jeez. Get off me. Get off my ass. We'll beat your ass. Trying to, trying to show who's dominant here. Super Saiyan! Yeah, so you press uh, X on the Super Nintendo controller. Damn it! To do that. Whoa, you, uh, what, you dissolve? Yeah, I guess. What? And I probably have to start over again. Great! That's great! From the beginning, From the beginning. Me? This is Castlevania, bro. There's, there's no forgiveness here. Wow, good to know. I was actually having this discussion with Dallin before. Dallin, if anything, I would say that Dark Souls is the new Castlevania. I'll uh, wait until he gets to see this video to get that tidbit of information. <laughs> yeah. Because I've never actually played Dark Souls, but to my understanding, it's kind of a bit of a horror element to it. Yeah. And it's completely unforgiving. Pretty much. I would say that's more of a success for the Castlevania than the new shitty-ass Castlevania games. Yeah, what was he saying is the... Uh, what it was is uh, he was watching Game Grumps. We're huge Game Grumps fans, by the way. Uh, he was watching Game Grumps, and Aaron commented how he uh, feels that Legend of Zelda is the successor to, uh, is like the new Dark Souls of this genre. No, fuck. I messed it all up. Dark Souls <laughs> right. is the new Legend of Zelda 1. And uh, I didn't quite agree with that when he asked me, and Dallin didn't actually either. He was just trying to spark an interesting conversation. And interesting it was. And uh, I would say, in my opinion, um, the Elder Scrolls games are the new Zelda games. And if we're going to compare something like that. But then again, I mean, we've all seen Sequelitis by now. I don't think you've seen Sequelitis, the Ocarina of Time one. Oh, I don't think I have. No, I might have to show you that. We've all seen Sequelitis by now, rest of internet, and uh, I think a lot of us didn't agree with Aaron's, <laughs> Aaron's opinions right there. Yeah. In fact, I was a little pissed off. A little bit. A little bit. But no need, you know, to really dwell on that. No, but, uh... I mean, it's everybody's entitled to their own opinion. And I mean, he even said, oh shit, that's right, that's why you go the other way. Fuck you! Oh good, it didn't come that far. Uh, he even said, like, I'm gonna get crucified for calling out Ocarina of Time on the internet. <laughs> Dude. If you're curious, I'm going this way for the turkey. Fuck that. Fuck 
you. Mm. See how much that's worth it? Holy crap. Seriously. Oof. Seriously, like you don't man, get knocked just, back. There's like... At least there's a rhythm to them. It's not like they randomly just zipped around. Oh, yeah. Like, if there was no rhythm to them, you'd be so fucked. I don't know. I mean, I still feel like if you had timed it, you could kill them, but... You wouldn't it's be able to... Huh! <laughs> and talking about rhythm. Ugh. You know what? I just realized the way he walks, he just looks like he's angry. He freaking like, kinda does. Oh, you know, he's freaking flying heads. It's like he's just like stomping <laughs> around everywhere. Like, oh my fucking god, I'm just so fucking pissed right now. Look at those Medusa heads just floating around. I'm getting all mad Damn about it. it. Quit touching me. Quit <laughs> touching me. <laughs> At least I made it to the screen today. Yeah, before you die again. Like, oh, yeah, like that, right there. Right there. Like when I die right there. Of course. Uh, Jamie just interrupted us there. That Jamie is my big sister. And uh, she showed us that we happen to have, for some reason... God damn it, this fucking... fucking I, I, there you we know, go. Maybe you should stop storytelling while you're trying to live. Uh, it's, just, it's probably a good idea. Okay, so Jamie told us uh, that we happen to have baby pictures of some of our uh, close family friends. And we have no idea why. These are like the original pictures. Oh, oh shit! You see that? Dude... Screw Dude, the, the knife axe. is awesome! Screw the axe! Oh yeah, it's this part. No, no, no. Fuck, fuck, fuck. It's okay, gone. Okay, well, yeah. It's done. It, it's yeah. done. It's done is done. It's done. Okay. Where, where'd you scout now? Arr. Okay. See, they're pretty much just killing themselves now. Yeah. Oh. Oh, if only I was good at Castlevania. Okay, at least I have one more life to... Try to take on Care Bears. Oh yeah, that's right. Do 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 do. Oh, uh, uh, I think this would actually be better for Care Bears. I want the knife back. That was awesome, dude. Seriously. Oh. Too bad that had to be left behind. Seriously. That was quite quite the thing. Quite mm -hmm. the thing. Oh, there he is. There he is, jumping around like a freaking puma. Boom. Boom ass bitch. Dude, look at that. Okay, that maybe you know what? Maybe maybe the boom. Maybe the boom is the a... boomerang for this guy for sure, dude. Oh. Booming. Yeah, double back, double back, just whoa. Whoa. Keep whoa. your distance. Fuck. Oh. And now I lost boomer. Is it all over? Oh uh, no, not okay. completely. So uh, you know a game that I actually much prefer to this one that is kind of similar? You know what? The original Ninja Gaiden games. Oh, like the NES ones. It's like the same idea. You get the weapons and you get power ups, and gotcha. it's really freaking hard. Oh, funny you should say that. I, I just, just remembered what the other game we had was. What? It was literally one of those game cartridges that just had packs of games. Oh. So in it, it had like, um, sh like Last Shogun or whatever that's called, or something. And then it had, uh, I think it might have actually had a version of Street Fighter that was a little more like. Streety. You know, so like you had like a. Or something. You had like a Chinese, uh. Chinese coffee cart? We might have. That's crazy. I'm not sure what. Yeah. Those are legal. Oh, seriously? Yeah. <laughs> well, not to like the point where if you're caught having one, they're gonna knock down your door, but like the production and sell of those are oh, illegal. Oh, right. I think well, I. Oh, fuck. I think I have Kerberos down to a damn it. To a science here. If you keep them in the corner, you really can't do much. Anyway, yeah, it had some fun stuff on there. I wish I could remember all the titles on there, because there was a few few popular ones. I'm sure it had, like, Streets of Rage on there. That might have been it. And then it had one that was, like, a barbarian-type game. Golden Axe. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Yeah, dude. It had some classics on there. To those of you not picking this quite up, Ian didn't wasn't hasn't always been a gamer. Yeah, no, I was... We started late. Let's just say when we had our Sega Genesis, everyone else had, like, 64, you know, and, uh... All that fun PS1 stuff. And that yeah, PS1 and stuff. And stuff. Our so, first uh, good console that was actually somewhat current was the. Uh, I was, beat him! Was like the original Xbox. Uh huh. There you go, you got him. Yeah, dude. Not a moment too soon. <laughs> it's a pain in the ass. I, see, I believe it. Okay, next time on uh, RCF, we're yeah. gonna go ahead and tackle stage two, because I'm feeling a little more of this. Yeah. I think I'm, I'll go to yeah. my next continue.